The heat that we had today, although we're going to be right on the edge tomorrow of a first alert or not, 104. Uh, is the expected high temperature, but then as we make our way into the weekend, the temperatures really begin to come down very well. By early next week, we're going to be talking about some 90s. 99 in Albuquerque, Phoenix at 115, 110 up in Vegas, 106 for the folks in Tucson, and we're looking at close in the Texas Panhandle. Uh, we have uh, 99s up there in Amarillo and the Lubbock area. So the triple today, again, 106, the record was 108, so we stayed away from a record, but 43 days now of seeing temperatures at 100 degrees or above. Now we're going to hit it tomorrow. That'll be 44, likely to get it on Saturday. That'll be 45. And then Sunday, we're anticipating those temperatures coming down into the upper 90s. But then once we head into August, we do have some triples again coming our way next week. So very likely we're going to certainly pass up in sixth place. And then we're just going to work our way up the ladder here, maybe getting into the fifth slot and outside chance number four. You can see number one, 62 days. That was in 1994. And if you uh, look at Doppler radar, we're tracking some showers and storms, not here, uh, up towards the north of us. You get around the Hatch area, that's where we're seeing some activity. Nothing big, these are just some light, moderate showers, but certainly a thunderstorm. You can kind of make out some of the lightning strikes here. And uh, then up there in the Gila, we're also tracking some rainfall. Here's your road and sidewalk temperatures. We're about 130, 135 with those temperatures and about the same up in Donata County in and around Las Cruces, Mesquite and over in the Vado area. So you may want to wait a little while yet before you take the dog out for a walk. Now in the meantime, consecutive days in a row right here at 42. Every day is a new record here in El Paso. And again, 43 is what we have for the entire season. The record was 62, as I mentioned back in 1994. 34 days for you guys in Las Cruces, taken over at New Mexico State University. Your record is 42, set back in 2020. There's a look at Doppler radar, I should say future track, right? It was our latest future track model. Showers and storms anticipated tonight. Look what happens. The model's indicating we set out an outflow boundary right here which, although the model's not showing any rain, we can't rule that out later on tonight. A very isolated chance, 10% chance, that's going to be about it. Then tomorrow we'll start off with sunshine, and then later in the day we'll track some of these showers and thunderstorms. Potentially it could move through here. Again, a 10% chance of seeing some rain in the forecast by late tomorrow night, and we'll continue with that chance as we make our way through the weekend. All right, we have some thunderstorm chances in the forecast. There's a shot from last year when we had the monsoon kicking in gear. And, Showers and storms, 100 on Saturday, 99 anticipated once we head into Sunday. And then notice the temperatures cooling down, 98 on Monday, then 99 on Tuesday. Here's some more triples coming back in the month of August on Wednesday and Thursday. We'll take a break.